Ryan. On we go. 14 all. Baxter's missed one dart for the match. Incredible, Rod Harrington. Well, I think we call it bottle, Stu. And that's what that was. We've seen bottle from both players. And that 80, you kind of, as you go through your career in this game, there's certain things that you do that make you believe that you're a good or even a great player. And certainly that 80 from Alan Tavern will prove to him that he's got it. He's got what it takes to win the big games. Well, I'm, I'm shaking my head in disbelief because these two have provided us with some rich, rich entertainment. A fifth maximum from Tavern, and now Baxter has to respond. And you wonder sometimes whether... He... As he goes for another one, 180 followed by 140. You wonder sometimes whether a tie-break situation would work here at the World Match Play, say possibly at 15 all to bring it in, or whether we just let the drama unfold. But Tavern here, who looked down and out, can break the throw. Bullseye for Tavern! Well, nowhere near, nowhere near. I think he got a bit excited. Well, he certainly picked into that one and he does that now to give him the third dart. 18 for top, so Ronnie Baxter. How important is this? Oh, now Tavern's going to have two darts to break the throw. We haven't seen it for a while. You've got to praise both players. Oh, one side, just the one side. He was aiming inside the barrel. Now Tavern has missed two chances to break. Double ten for Baxter. Everyone holds their breath. It's incredible, Stu. They take out shots under pressure and then get three darts and a double and miss. Alan Tavern probably thought he weren't going to come back to break Ronnie Baxter's throw. 32, big deep breath and just let it go. And that's covered it a little bit. Move again to the right, you can see the target. Just pure, pure pressure. That's all it is. The adrenaline will be flowing through the veins. Baxter didn't expect this chance. Can he take it? Yes, he can. It's 50 14. On we go. That could turn out to be a massive hole for Ronnie Baxter. It certainly can. And, uh, Two great games coming up after this, and the hard thing for them to do is to, to know exactly, especially the next game, when they're actually going to get on stage. They prepare themselves possibly to be on 15, 20 minutes ago, and we may be an hour away. You don't know. Now oh, it's fabulous to watch, pure and simple, isn't it? Thank you. Everyone in the Winter Gardens on the edge of their seats. I'm sure you watching at home will be on the edge of the sofa as well. We just don't know which way it's going to go. Baxter's already missed one dart for the match in the 28th leg. And Tavern in the last leg blowing five darts at double 16 to break. Alan Tavern keeps dipping into that last start nine times out of ten when he does that it, it goes awry he really has to you know keep his height in that last start needs the trebles there we see that dip again and it's always nowhere near the treble when he throws that dart what can Baxter do to pressurise as well, an important dart with the last one, Baxter is an advantage, Ronnie Baxter, Tavern's already taken out 157 to stay alive in the match, Baxter is going to get a chance here to win it, well he's going to get a dart at least at the bullseye but don't miss the big numbers, you ain't hit the treble, don't, he's hit the treble, double 14 for the match, Oh, Baxter's done it! A brilliant dart! The rocket is firing! What a dramatic finale to a fabulous, fabulous match! Baxter snatches it in extra.
extra time to go through to the quarterfinals. The crowd are on their feet. Brilliant. Brilliant drama at the World Match Play. And more drama to come. Don't go anywhere. It's Barney on the stage soon.